The Devil's Rejects was written and directed by Rob Zombie and it stars Bill Mosley, Sharon Moon Zombie, and Sid Haig. And this movie is a sequel to House of a Thousand Corpses and this movie is about Baby, Otis, and Captain Spaulding running away from the cops for what they did in the first movie. And one of the cops is hell-bent on getting revenge on the three. So House of a Thousand Corpses was weird, over the top, and a little disturbing. Well, The Devil's Rejects kind of does away with over the top and weird. I mean, yeah, there's still some of that in the movie, but it goes for more disturbing and to really fuck you up. Now, I like Otis and Captain Spaulding's characters uh, even more in this movie. They feel more sinister and more evil. I still don't like Baby. She's still over the top. Maybe not as much in the as in the first one. But yeah, she just really brings me out of the movie. I really don't like her scenes. But I honestly find this movie more disturbing than the original Texas Chainsaw Massacre. And I believe it's because there's blood and gore in this movie. And if you've seen the original Texas Chainsaw Massacre, you would know that there's hardly any blood in that movie. And... I don't think I mentioned that in my review of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, but that's another problem I have with that movie. It would have been more disturbing. I mean, it's already disturbing enough, but it would have been even more disturbing if we would have seen uh, more gore and blood. So I can't say too much more about this movie since it's a sequel and I don't want to spoil anything. But yeah, that's basically my thoughts about the movie. And another thing I had to mention is Rob Zombie pick some really good songs to to have in the movie uh i really liked them even more than the first movie and i also like this movie a little more than the first and i'm gonna give the devil's rejects a b so if you like the texas chainsaw massacre you would probably like these two films uh, definitely give them a watch and i know that uh rob zombie just came out with a third one called the three from hell this year I don't plan on watching that one because in uh, at the end of The Devil's Rejects, I thought that was a perfect ending of uh, what happened. And I don't see how the hell they made a third one, uh, but okay. And that's why I don't really want to watch it because it would probably ruin the ending to that movie. And I think that was a good conclusion to, to those two movies. So yeah, I don't care about watching the third one. I heard it's really bad anyway. So I don't want to waste, waste my time with it. But yeah, guys, that's it for this review. Remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys tomorrow.